Good afternoon, Amanda. It is um, Thursday, the 21st of July. And as you can see, I changed my hair. It looks kind of cool, I think. Um, I did these pieces so I can change the color whenever I feel the need to, you know. Um, but otherwise, I'm kind of liking the dark look, and I'm not a ginger anymore. Like I said in my last video, it would be the last one seeing my ginger hair. Wait, was that the one before that? Oh, I lied. I hate lying. I'm sorry. <laughs> Any oh, anyway, back on track now. Um, as you can see, I'm doing my vlog from outside today. Yep. Joy in the nature. Um, ew, there are bugs on my computer. Didn't think this through very well. Just thought I'd like the scenery. Anyway, um, I'm going to answer the questions you asked. Um, your first question was, which green brother is my favorite, Hank or John? I like them both for different reasons, but I think I like Hank more because, well, you know how hyper I am, and obviously he's hyper too. I think that that kind of relates to me, and I think it's just funny that whenever he's on espresso, he balks like a chicken. That is some points. Though John, he seems like, um, they're both extremely smart, but I think John is just smart in a different way. Like, I am more, I like reading and music, but I seem to have a bit more interest in music sometimes, even though I love books. I only read books and I cannot dance. Yeah. Anyway. Um, so Hank would be my answer for that one. It was a hard choice. My favorite book right now would probably, it's probably Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows. Just because I didn't think, even though I love reading, I didn't think one book could cause that severe and mixed emotions. Like, I had so many emotions going on at one time, I felt like I was going to blow up. Like, but yeah. Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows. A very Potter musical or a very Potter sequel. That is a very hard job. <gasps> Amanda! I'm sitting under the tree where I made our wands. We made our wands and I found the one that died. I found a piece of its carcass. I don't know where the rest of it is, but... This is awesome. <laughs> Back on track now. Like I said, the hyper-random stuff, that's that's me. Um, I just thought that was pretty awesome, though. Um, where was I? A very Potter musical or a very Potter sequel? Right, right, right. I'm probably leaning towards the sequel, even though I adore both of them. It was a very difficult choice. But I like a very Potter musical because it's the first one and has the, the first musical number. so awesome, and I just think... It's hilarious whenever Bellatrix gets mad at Voldemort and she leaves and he's just like, Now I have two people mad at me! But, I don't know. Um, the second one I love because Joe Walker's Umbridge. I don't, I don't think I've laughed harder at anything in my life. Ever. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's crazy. I love it. Um... Let's see, and I like it because it has the whole red vine things. Favorite way to say red wines in a German accent? Red vines. And um, and it has the beginning, <laughs> the Weasleys, go on Fred, but I'm Fred. You got an F on your shirt. <laughs> and the, I think I got it. That was so awesome. I just love the Weasleys in Harry Potter and a Harry Potter musical. Both of them. Weasleys are just like, I want them as my family. Um, and, and the whole Hermione can't draw, Hermione can't draw, Hermione cannot draw. She only reads books and she cannot draw, even if she's reading a how to draw a book. That thing, that has become the theme song to my life lately because I'm singing everything. I've been singing about my dog. It's called Tila Can't Grow. It's awesome. My dog. I might be able to show you my dog, 
but I'm not sure if I can pause the video and go get her and, and I might just have to walk through my house to go get the dog. I don't know. We'll see about that when the time comes. The, it's already over five minutes, but I'm going to keep on going because I actually wrote a script for this video, so it's going to be exceptionally awesome today. Um, and it also has the, ah, night troll, but I'm just a little girl, and, and has Lupin in it. Lupin in that is absolutely brilliant. No way we're losing to Slytherin or Ravenclaw or Jigglypuff. It's just, I love it. And my favorite movie, probably either the Harry Potter Chamber of Secrets, Goblet of Fire, Deathly Howard, Hallows, Deathly Hallows, Part 2, or Zombieland. Harry Potter definitely has to be in there multiple times just because it's so epic, you know? No way that could ever be left out. Um favorite food that's next right um because you know i'm a maryland raised girl i love crab cakes and seafood and all that jazz love it um color the last name joke was really low i get that so much i trusted you <laughs> Okay, um, but anyway, um, probably purple, then green, then blue, so you were close, even the last name thing, ugh, um, and animal, a hippogriff, okay, alright, I'll, I'll do something more realistic, a puppy-sized elephant, that's not real either, um, fine, Seagull. Seagull, you know. I like birds. Uh, and the last question. I love when the coffee's done. Um, and next I'm going to just talk about a few of my nerdy quirks. Just to add something other than the questions into this video. I dye my hair weird colors all the time. I'm an artless and I'm an I'm an artist of pointless things that's what I'm trying to say like last year I spent like an hour at my friends Michaela's house drawing her a bean in a sombrero playing a ukulele and he had like a curly mustache and all that and I'm like why did I spend so long on this and I spent a while drawing the banana and the um, guy from the rejected cartoons that goes I am a banana and all that and I just realized today how much I love pudding. I love pudding way too much to be normal. Like those delight things with the strawberry and the chocolate, like we get those in the fridge and they're not, they don't last very long because I'm just like, ah. and um, food. I eat like crazy and I don't know how I'm not like a billion pounds. I'm not like stick skinny, but I prob, but I don't know how I'm an actual average weight whenever I eat all the time. That's not exactly nerdy, but I was just thinking about that earlier, and I'm like, I don't know what is with this, but lemonade, lemonade, I drink lemonade all the time, it's like, can't live without it, like I said in my last video, lemonade is just my thing. Um, I'm really awkward, it may not seem like this because I'm by myself making a video, which I have no life, and that's one of the reasons because is I'm awkward. Blah, blah, blah. I mean, I'm so. I just don't know how to interact with people very well. Like, one time I was over at a friend's house, and she's just like, let's go outside. And I'm like, there's people out there. I don't want to go outside. And, I, and then it just hit me how much truth there was in my words that that was the reason. <laughs> but. I always space out a lot, like you'll just catch me looking somewhere, and it's like I'll be looking at someone and I don't even realize it, and they'll be like, why are you staring at me? And I'm like, I was staring at you? And I make up weird songs all the time, like my mom and I made up a billion different variations to Hermione Can't Draw last night, and she finally got annoyed with it. She's She still won't watch a Harry Potter musical, and I'm like, okay, suit yourself, but... And I just take pictures of really weird things. Like, for some reason, if my food looks really yummy, I'll take a picture of it. And I don't really know why. But, you know. 
and um I think I'll make this video a little longer just so I can um take the computer inside to see my dog she's really adorable chihuahua which you know that but the like four people that watch our videos don't I mean seriously why do people not watch our videos I'll take us inside and give us a little tour while I'm going. That's stuff behind me. <laughs> I'm good at saying things. And we're about to walk in the door of my house, the back door. And the dogs are away from the dog room for a little while. So I can walk in here without being attacked, you know, by Sophie. And you can hear my dog. She's starting to bark. And then we'll just have a few minutes of chihuahua cuteness at the end of this. Just to maybe get us some hits. That sounds like we're promoting violence. Keep hitting. Tila, she is coming here. The TV was on from this morning. Excuse the noise. This is my dog. Isn't she cute? And the song, she has a lazy eye. See, she looks so weird. But she's really small and she's like three or four years old. So we made up Tila can't grow, Tila can grow, Tila cannot grow. She only really barks, she cannot grow. Even if she was barking about how to grow. It's a really bad song, but you know, it, it works for some purposes anyway <clears throat> that's about it so bye i'll see your video um tomorrow bye since tila don't forget to be awesome